In this video we'll make a sparkle brush and we'll put the sparkle on the edge of that glass like that there. So I'll delete that top layer. First we choose our brush in the brush dialog. Come over here and we choose one of the brushes, it doesn't matter which one. Come down to the bottom here and click on create a new brush icon. Click on that one. Up here we choose the diamond and now the radius needs to be around about 75. Now you bring the cursor in from behind because otherwise if you go in from the front it gives you the up arrow. Type in 75, just highlight it. Come down to spikes, now you can use the tumbler on this one, just click on 5 to make it like a pentastar. Hardness needs to be, once again you come in from behind, needs to be 0.09, so we click on 0.09. Aspect ratio needs to be 1.6. Now we can just use the tumbler on that. Just click on the 0.6. The angle doesn't really matter because you can change it over in the brush dialog. And same with the spacings. Now we need to give it a name because it will become permanent. We just say star and press enter. Now it's in your brush dialog down the bottom there. It'll always be there when you close GIMP and reopen it again, it'll be there. It's a permanent brush now. You can delete it by right clicking on it and then clicking on the uh, delete the brush. Now we go back to our layer dialog. We create a new layer. OK. Now we have our brush selected. And we've got our brush tool. We change our colour to white. Now the size of the brush is far too small. So I need to just put the uh, cursor in there and bring it up to around about there. Around about 460 will do. Uh, change your colour to white. We've done that by using the two arrows. Just put it on the edge of the glass and click once. That's our sparkle. You can use that on other things like the uh, paint finish on a car as well. So uh, rate the video and the link below is to a website on instructions on how to do this in a hard copy.